Hey, this is Brian Jones from eLearning Art. Today I'm going to show you how you can ungroup clip art and change it to meet whatever your needs are. So let's go ahead and get into this slide here. Um, I'm in PowerPoint here and let's uh, let's get a better zoom there. That looks good. Um, so basically I, everything on the left here is the clip art that I started with and then what's on the right here is how I um, ungrouped it and modified it. So here you'll see I made it from the, you know, the chart going up to the chart going down. Here I actually changed the time on the clock and, uh, and then here I actually ungrouped and then combined these two elements or pieces of these two elements to create you know, this alien with the, with the body. So let's actually just um, throw away uh, we'll just let's not throw it away. Let's move it. Let's move everything off screen. Okay, so the first thing I want to do, let's start with the bar chart. And I'm going to control D to duplicate it and drag it over here. And um, now I want to ungroup this uh, this clip art so that I can edit some of the, the pieces. So ungroup, yes, and you always have to do it twice. It's just a weird thing. Ungroup. Okay, so there are a ton of little elements here and um, we don't. I want to keep the grid the same. So what I want to do is I know that it's a few different pieces. It's the arrow head there, and then the line. So let's go ahead and click that, and then Control and click on this. Make that a single shape, and I'm going to Control G to group those. So now these are a single group. Um, and really, all I want to do is flip it upside down. So um, if I go to Format, and I just go to Rotate, and I can uh, flip it vertically. And there we go. And I actually I changed it to red, and um, and you can change the color. Oh, I want to change the whole thing. There, let's make that red too. There. And um, you know, we could actually you know, we can change it a little bit. You know, drag it around. Um, but I actually liked how it was. It was it was fine. Um, so that's a simple one. Let's go ahead and move to the clock. And so let's duplicate this clock. Control D. Let's drag it over here. And the same thing, we want to break it apart. So Control Shift G, yes. Control Shift G again to ungroup it. Now here's an interesting thing. Um, this didn't do exactly what I wanted it to, and sometimes it's not going to. Um, this ended up as a single piece and not three individual elements. So um, what I did to change that was I actually just um, made that shape myself. So um, I went to Insert a Shape. And let's grab circle, and if I hold shift, it will lock the aspect ratio, and we can make, uh, you know, that looks about right. And then I inserted another shape, I inserted a line, and you know, let's draw that line there. Looks good. And let's duplicate the line, make this one a little shorter, like so. And then let's duplicate this one. And we will actually put that down here, and we can, you know, rotate it however you want to. But now we need to make these, this one and this one, a little thicker. So let's uh, right-click, format object, line style. Let's just get the thickness up a little bit. That's looking good. Let's take it to three, and call that good. Now we want to color everything black. So let's make that black. And actually, this circle I want to have. Uh, let's format it. I'll go no line on that one. Okay, and then we can change the line colors to black, and then we're good. And then we can just you know, take those, throw them in there. And maybe the sizing's not perfect, but. You now I could I could tweak that. Oh, that looks pretty good. Um, oh, I like I'd like that to be a little bit longer. So let's do that. And uh, good enough. I could go back and tweak that really quickly. I want to get into this. Let's go ahead and uh, duplicate this. Control D, and we're going to combine these shapes. So now Control G, Control Shift G, ungroup. Yes, Control Shift G, ungroup. Let's get rid of the shapes I don't want. And Let's take this, duplicate it, Control Shift G, ungroup, so that I can recolor it, and now throw that head on there. Let's get, oops, get the clock out of the way, and turn it green. 